Hey guys, it's Marty Geek. In this video, I'm bringing you some gameplay for WWE 2K18 on the Nintendo Switch because we just got an update, a firmware patch for this game. Uh, it's going to show you guys right away what version is it now. It's version 1.02. 1.02. Um, it took me a while to download because I actually did it on using my hotspot from my phone yesterday, last night at work. Um, it really didn't add that much. Like you see here, this game is totally digital, no physical game at all. So right now it's 21.5 gigabytes. Uh, so I can't remember if it, if it was the same amount of size before the update. Uh, but, you know, right now here I'm playing my career. And I just wanted to share with you guys a couple things. Like, for example, I noticed uh, right here in the camera, like you see here, looking around, the camera feels really smooth. Uh, before, it felt really, really slow. It felt uh, like in slow motion, like if the, if the camera was moving in slow motion. Um, also, one of my critiques here about the playing my career mode, which is one of my favorite modes of this game is that the walking and the running was really, really, really slow, even when you're running. Uh, so right here, you like, see here, he's walking and it actually feels normal. You know, it doesn't feel slow at all. When you're running, it actually feels that he's actually speeding up. Uh, here, if I try to talk, um, this, of course, the conversations are actually done like this. There's no like cut, cool cutscenes with dialogue. Uh, there isn't. You know, like in NBA 2K18, actually has, you know, has like a cutscene with true dialogue. Here you don't get that, so I don't, I don't get it why this game, you know, took so long to fix. But like you see here, the running is way faster. For me, in my opinion, it moves a lot more faster than before. Another huge thing here is this guy. Um, let me go and show you guys a, a video that I posted on instagram a long time ago look at this guy this is uh todd M mullen todd mullen look at his face how it looked before the, the patch it always for me i don't know if everybody got this same error but for me it always this guy always looked like that no face whatsoever uh, the guy is white like you see here the guy is white and he had no face whatsoever the only thing visible was his eyes not even his mouth or teeth or anything like that so it was really 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 bad and it was so distracting that i just stopped i just stopped playing it but now look at this when i, I the first thing i did was go here to my career and see this guy's face and look at that totally fixed you can see his his scars his his expressions, his hair, and all that. Everything looks great compared to what it looked before. It says, win a mid-match running. Ah, that sucks. I don't want to do that. That sucks. Um, but, like you see there, that right away fixed a lot of problems that I had with the my career mode, which is horrible. Uh, that thing was horrible. Another thing here, which is kind of weird, is that, see, it says, press B to view card match right you press b nothing happens and that's a problem that was happening before and it actually didn't get fixed look at this press b and i know it's not b it's actually a but here it says press b so if i press b i could be pressing b all day all night every week until next year and it'll still do nothing if i press a there you go it fixes the problem so that didn't get fixed that was that was um i was having that problem um before the update so and i guess i still have the problem right now so right here it says do a mid-run match so i guess i have to interfere in somebody's match i'm gonna go ahead and choose let me see uh, let's go and choose randy orton and let's go and try to see if i can go through that and let's go and show you guys um the loading time the loading time here dun, 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 dun. let's go and wait for the, the screen to show up the loading screen there you go uh, next there we have go. singles action it's aiden english versus ah. luke harper as Crap. the makings of a classic didn't i choose randy orton 
and AJ. I don't know. I guess this is the match that I actually have to do the running. I guess this is the match. So, like you see there, um, um, the only thing that I haven't noticed improvement is in loading time when it comes to career mode. Uh, in career mode, the loading time has been taking over a minute, uh, which is kind of annoying. But yeah, but when you're actually playing the normal games, like the, you know, the normal exhibition games, like six man matches and all that, uh, the loading time is pretty fast is around 30 to 40 seconds which is for me is normal uh but here on um, my career has been always taking over a minute look at that all already 59 already one minute already and we're still waiting there so it's barely passing the mid midpoint so yeah that's one thing that I, I noticed that's not been improved is the loading time which kind of sucks because in my career, there's a lot of loading time. You know, you go to matches, then you come back to your, you know, there you go. Okay, that is done right there, right? There you go, 128. 128, that's insane. So that's how much it actually took, 128. Um, Cutscenes, um, the entrances, I know there was a lot of complaints about the entrances. Um, they do they do sometimes feel slow motion but it has been improved in my opinion they have been improved um i'm trying to see because these two don't have good interests it's hard to show you guys uh their interests but you know most of the interests i've seen they feel pretty good you can still notice a little bit of slow motion look at that see his arm going up and all that you know i really don't know if that's the way he does it but it does look a little bit a little bit slow but in my opinion it is way improved than before Don't press that. okay so right here i think i'm supposed to interfere in the match i'm supposed to win so right now I'm not controlling any one of them. There you go. So there you go. Here comes my character. There you go. I'm 2G. <laughs> so we're supposed to win, right? I'm supposed to help Luke Harper win. And I think this is a no DQ match. So, yeah, I don't know what the hell am I supposed to... I think I'm supposed... It says return. I don't want to return. Return where? Check Back to the... the right here, I can... If I want, I can interfere there. Okay, my character is stuck there now. Look at that. My character will move. I'm trying to move my character. One. Two. Look at this. Okay, look at this. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Right on video. So, like you see there, I am not faking this. <laughs> right now, I need to get out. Because if I don't get out, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get him disqualified. See, warning, warning, and it's not letting me get out. Hey, guy. Hey, dude. Come on. Ah, look at this. Oh, I can't believe it. Honestly, guys, I was not expecting this. Look at this. I'm trying to get out. I'm trying to move my character, and he won't do nothing. And I'm just gonna get disqualified. See? Ejected. 
the there you go. You. I got ejected. That sucks. Okay, so here now we're going to go ahead and show you guys a six-man Hell in a Cell match. Uh, so that way you guys can see a little bit of gameplay, how it feels and how it looks with a whole bunch of people inside of the ring. Uh, right now I am playing as... Um, yes, as that guy. <laughs> as um, Kurt Angle. I'm going to lower the volume a little bit just in case because of copyright issues. Um... Just gonna show you guys a little bit of the entrance so you guys can see there. Look at that. Kurt Angle actually, the character actually looks pretty badass. He always looked pretty badass. And I think it still looks pretty good too. Um, like you see there, a little bit of slow motion when he's walking. See there, when he's walking, a little bit of slow motion you can notice. Kinda sucks. Uh, keep in mind, I have Kurt Angle because I er pre-ordered the game, so I got him for free as a as a bonus for pre-ordering the game. And there you go, there. Knock on the door. We got Goldberg. Goldberg. There you go. I got him because I actually purchased it. Um, you can actually unlock players in this game by using the in-game currency. And when I pre-order it, I think I got like 6,000 or 10,000 um, points or money. So I decided to go ahead and purchase him so I like him. I like him. He looks pretty badass. And his entrance looks pretty good. He looks pretty good. You know, look his hair, his head and all that. His tattoo. The character model actually looks pretty good. You can see the fireworks going off. There you go. There you go. So I don't know what I can say, but I don't think it looks better than the PlayStation 4 or Xbox One. But, you know, <laughs> I don't know. Judge by yourself. I actually think, like I said, I think it looks better than before. But you can still notice, you know, the slow motion, even in the fire effect, uh, fireworks. Like you see there in the fireworks, you can actually see the easily. You can easily see the slowness there. Look at his uh, smoke coming out of his nose. Now he starts swinging. There you go. Wow. <laughs> <Look at that. laughs> Woohoo! So like you see there, a little bit slow. Like you see, still a little slow. So let's go ahead and skip. So we can start skipping to the match. I'm going to go ahead and skip all the other entrances. So we can go ahead and straight to the match. Okay, so here we are back again. Finally, we're going to go ahead and do the fighting here. The six men in the ring. There you go. I'm over here as Kurt Angle. I'm kicking um, Sami Zayn's ass. <laughs> or, oh, well, he reversed it. Come on. So there you go. So, you see there, there's six men in the ring, in my opinion. Way better than before as well. Way better than before. Uh, I, I remember seeing a whole bunch of videos where the, the gameplay was impossible to enjoy. Um, here, like you see there, you got everybody on the screen, and it feels way better. Way better. See there? Kurt Angle doing his move. Turn to the ring. Oh, he reversed it. Too late. So, of course, this match is everybody for himself. Everybody has to fight everybody. I actually like prefer doing the tornado six man match because uh, you got three versus three. I think that's and everybody's in the ring at the same time. I think that's for me is better. I was gonna actually do that, but you know, I'm pretty sure you guys wanted to see this instead because uh, all the videos that I've seen online was 
you know, this mode being unplayable, completely unplayable because of the frame rate issues when there's more than, almost, there's like six people online. There you go, DDT. <laughs> Another thing that also was improved that I was really, it had me annoyed before was the targeting. Targeting was horrible in this, uh, the first game, and the game without the patch because Every time I tried to target like a specific wrestler, it would just show me another name. It would just show me another name and target the wrong person with the wrong name. Um, here, you see there right now, if I target Sami Zayn, okay, I'm targeting Sami Zayn, of course. But I'm it's going to be hard to show you guys. There you go. Get in, get in. Get in. There you go. So right now, if I want to target Seth Rollins, or let's say Goldberg right here, you see there, I actually am targeting Goldberg, and I can see the his Go, Goldberg name over my head because that's the guy that I'm targeting. That was bad before. I was having that was annoying me because it would actually say one name, and you he would actually be targeting another person. You know, which wasn't the person that I was supposed to be targeting. So, yeah. Oh, Sami Zayn is targeting me now. Crap, too late. I think I have a signature. I think I have a signature move. Let's go and try to... Okay, let's go and try to do it now to Sami Zayn. Sorry, I'm going to do you. I'm going to give you a good little gift here. <laughs> oh, crap, he reversed it. Now, sir, guys, I'm not going to be able to finish this match because it's going to take forever. It's going to actually take forever to finish this match. I already tried to record another video of a six-man match, and it actually took me like 40 minutes to finish the match because I couldn't get a pin. You know, every time I try to get a pin, I would be get disrupted or reversed or I would actually do the finisher but somebody else would interfere so I did record uh, this game in game capture and you see here you got Finn Balor okay, I'm targeting Gover Seth Rollin okay let me go ahead and target Seth Rollin okay there you go Seth Rollin Okay, no, nope. Sami Zayn got me now again. So you see there, automatically he it switches to Sami Zayn as my target because he actually started targeting me. So I'm happy with that because it's the, the target system is working now. Ooh. Sami Zayn, there you go. I keep beating on Sami Zayn. <laughs> Holy crap. I'm <laughs> going to try to get Randy Orton there. There you go. Let's do the special. Let's do the signature. There you go. There you go. Let's go for a ride. There you go. <laughs> yeah, one more time. There you go. 
He's going to do the finisher. Angle slam. He's going to try to get the count. One. Two. And it got broken. There you guys got it. There you have it. So I can see there, um, this match is going to take forever because it's a six-man tag match or six-man Hell in a Cell match. And um, it's just going to take forever. So I'm not going to finish the video here in... Um, you know, I'm not going to finish the fight here in this video. But, you know, I do want to say that there has been improvements. Um, it's not perfect. It's still not perfect compared to the console. Uh, you can still notice some slowness when they're entering the ring. Uh, but I believe it has been improved. Also, the six-man tag me, uh, six-man fight, I think it's way better now. It's a lot more playable now than before. Uh, you can actually have a fight. You know, you can actually have a fight and enjoy it. Um, yes, it has some bugs here and there, but compared to before, it is way improved. Way, way improved. So, right there, I'm kicking out Randy Orton's ass uh, again, you know, just like I like to do. Uh, but, you know, it looks really good. I think it looks way better than before. Right now, I'm going to be playing it. I'm happy because right now, I'm going to be able to enjoy this game now until the next big game comes out for the Switch. Uh, which is going to be um, Bayonetta, I think it is, Bayonetta. So guys, thanks for watching this video. This was a little bit of gameplay uh, update for WWE 2K18 on the Nintendo Switch. Uh, like I said, you got to see a couple of the improvements. I hope uh, this video helped you out. In my opinion, you know, it is, it is worth buying. It is worth buying, especially if you are a... WWE fan, I think it's worth buying now than before. Uh, it does feel good. So yeah, thanks for watching this video, guys. Let me know what you think about it. Uh, if you want to see something else, another gameplay, I was, I felt, I feel like uploading a gameplay with uh, Charlotte. You guys, that way you guys can enjoy it, which looks pretty good. I'll try to do that later on. Thanks for watching this video, guys. Till next time.